What's up guys, it's Carter and I'm back with another video. Today is a max effort upper day and uh, the variation for this week is the football bar and um, I'm using my Elite FTS American Camber Bar and I just took the band and uh, strapped a foam block kind of into that camber so I could kind of just negate that camber a little bit so I could just get a regular football bar press without the camber. And I'm just working up to a uh, top single. And I uh, went ahead and went for 310. This is a 40 pound bar. So just going for 310 here. And it's coming up nice. And I hit the edge of the J cups, but hung it up. And that, folks, is a PR. A little dramatic, maybe, but uh, I think that's the first PR I've had on the channel. Uh, definitely since I've been doing the vlog, so uh, I was pretty pretty happy about that. So we are making progress, and while cutting at that, so I'm pretty happy about that. Really wasn't expecting to be making uh, progress during the cut. I kind of expected or hoped to just at least stay where I was at during the cut, and that would be I'd consider that a win. So definitely getting a PR uh, today felt really good, and I'm really happy about it. So. I will take that. And then we moved on to some back off work. Uh, same setup, same bar here. Five sets of 10. 60% uh, of the training max I just hit. So that puts me at 185. And just repping it out for some good hypertrophy work. Then I moved on to the pull downs. Uh, I opted for the pull downs this session rather than the pull ups because after I did the pull ups, my the tendons in my arm uh, were really, really sore the following day, still sore the day after that, and uh, they actually felt better today, which I was pretty happy about, but I decided to uh, not push it and just, you know, possibly alternate these exercises for a couple weeks to see how it feels and uh, kind of just give my arm a chance to adapt. And you can see I'm kind of using a different setup here. Uh, for one thing, I'm using a chair instead of my bench because I really didn't feel like taking apart the whole uh, belt squat setup because I got to use it tomorrow for uh, max effort lower day. But I also went ahead and purchased the uh, gym pin uh, lat pull down bar and I have the uh, angles 90 grips attached to it. And then we moved on to plate front raises. Uh, I'm assuming coach feels I need a little more front delt. Uh, we haven't really done any direct shoulder work up to this point. I think when I first got on, he had me doing a little bit of lateral raises. There's some side delt, but uh, no direct front delt work. So I'm assuming he thinks I need a little more front delt for the pressing, and he may be right. So um, I'm using a 45 pound plate here, and I've never really done these before. I've done you know front raises, I've done upright rows, stuff like that, but never plate raises. Uh, but you know, pretty simple exercise, nothing much to it. And I turned the hat backwards to go full on bro mode for these. <laughs> and then we ended with some tricep band press downs. And these really seem to be a staple in my programming. And they're primarily for my tendon health. You got to keep these tendons healthy. I have a history of inflammation. And then it doesn't hurt to uh, put a little more meat on the triceps as well. So that's going to be it for the video today, guys. I appreciate you watching. Drop a comment below. Hit that like button for me if you enjoyed the content. If you're new to the channel, hit that subscribe, and I'll see you in the next one.